homework five, um, question one. So question is, uh, when x and y are independent with fx of x equals to u of x minus one minus u of x minus two, and then fy of y equals to u of y minus u uh, of y minus one, and z equals to x plus one, find the fz of z. So for the first question, I uh, use the convolution uh, method. So we know that fz of z equals to uh, fx of z times the fy of z, which equals to um, the integral from uh, negative infinity to infinity, fx of the alpha uh, times fy of z minus alpha d alpha. So, and then, um, um, we, so for this question, we just need to uh, shift the re result right side uh, by to to the right side by one later. So for fz of z is equal to the integral from negative infinity to infinity fx of alpha uh, times fy of z minus alpha d alpha. Now um, we are plugging uh, the fx and the fy um, into that equation. Um, we get um, fz of z equals to uh, from negative infinity to infinity um, u alpha minus u alpha minus one uh, times u of uh, z minus alpha uh, times that z minus alpha minus one d alpha. So um, we do the calculation um, is equal to from negative infinity to infinity u alpha times u z minus alpha d alpha uh, minus the integral of from negative infinity to infinity u alpha uh, times u times uh, u of z minus 1 minus alpha d alpha uh, minus uh, integral of from negative infinity to infinity u of alpha minus 1 times u of z minus alpha d alpha plus um, in the integral of from negative infinity to infinity u of alpha minus 1 times u of z minus 1 minus alpha d alpha. So uh, after all the calculation, uh, we can get the answer will be uh, fz of z equal to z times u of z minus uh, z minus 1 times u of z minus 1 minus uh, z minus 1 times u of z minus 1 plus z minus 2 times u of z minus 2. And now we shifted the fz of z uh, uh, to the right by just 1. So we get um, fz of z eventually equal to z minus 1 times u of z minus 1 minus 2 of z minus 2 times u of z minus 2 plus z minus 3 times u of z minus 3, which is the graph, um, the triangle graph, look like the graph, the, the triangle shape in the graph. For the second one, uh, it's asking to use in geometric method. So when uh, z equals to x plus y, fx of x uh, equal to u of x minus u x minus 1, fy of y uh, equals to u of y minus u of y minus 1. So the capital Fz of z would be equal to probability of um, the capital Z smaller than equal to z equals to the probability of x plus 1 smaller than equal to z. So when uh, z smaller than 1, the capital Fz of z is equal to um, uh, z squared over 2. So we know the Fz of z would be just uh, the derivative of the capital Fz of z which will be equal to z. And for when z is uh, smaller than equal to 2 and um, bigger than 1, the capital Fz of z is equal to probability of z smaller than z would equal to the z squared over 2 minus 2 times z minus 1 squared over 2, which equal to uh, negative z squared over 2 plus 2z minus 1. So the smaller uh, fz of z would be equal to the derivative of that, which is just the negative z plus 2. And when uh, uh, z is bigger than 2, uh, we know the capital fz of z is just equal to 1. So the smaller fz of z is just equal to 0. So the graph will be look like uh, the triangle shape. And then uh, shape. And then now we just uh, um, shift the answer by to the right by just one. So we get the f z of z is equal to z minus one times u of z minus one minus uh, two times z minus two times u of z minus two plus z minus three times u of z minus three.